simplify this expression. So if we look closely at this expression, this bracket is being multiplied by this bracket. This bracket in the denominator is being multiplied by the terms of this bracket and then finally they are divided. So let's solve the numerator first. In the numerator part, I will multiply 1 fourth times 2 third. x4 is being multiplied by x6. Their bases are same. They are being multiplied. So by the laws of exponents, the exponents will get added. So x4 plus 6. y cube, y4. Again, the exponents will be added. z, what is the exponent of z? It's 1. So 1 plus 9. So we have solved the numerator. Let's do the same with the denominator. So multiply 3 8 with one third x 3 added to negative 6 y negative 4 added to negative 1 and z negative 7 added to plus 7 now multiply the fractions 1 times 2 2 4 times 3 12 x 4 plus 6 10 y 3 plus 4 7 z 1 plus 9 10 3 times 1, 3. 8 times 3, 24. x, 3 added to minus 6 is minus 3. y, negative 4 added to negative 1 is negative 5. z, negative 7 added to 7 is 0. This is equal to 2 twelfths. Now, when we are dividing the two fractions, basically the division is same as multiplication with the reciprocal of second fraction. So, multiply with the reciprocal of 3 24s. So, that's 24 threes, thirds. Now, x. Now, this x 10 divided by x minus 3. So, let's again use the law of exponent. So, when the bases are same, they are being divided. So, the exponents get subtracted. Y, 7 minus minus 5 z 10 minus 0 12 times 2 is 24 so 2 times 2 is 4 4 third x minus minus positive plus 10 plus 3 13 y minus minus plus 7 plus 5 12 10 minus 0 10 and that's our answer